Hello, beautiful black people. Beautiful, beautiful black people. I hope that this day ended uh, as a very, very good day for you and all of your wonderful, wonderful loved ones. My beautiful, intelligent black brothers and sisters, you do know that the Republican Party right here on this plantation called America is a party of traitors and criminals. And 99 and 9 tenths percent of them, the traitors and the criminals, are white boys and white girls. Although there is one black coon to the nth degree and his name is Tim Scott out of Charleston, South Carolina, I believe. Remember that name. U.S. Senator Tim Scott. He is a coon to the nth degree. On television, national television, a few days ago, he said that this plantation called America is not a racist country. That coon, to the nth degree, said that with 15 white boys standing behind him surrounding him. He did his step and fetch it interpretation right there on national television with 15 racist white boys surrounding him, laughing at him in disguise because they were thoroughly being entertained by that coon named Tim Scott. Just as Clarence Thomas, the United States Justice on the Supreme Court, they are laughing at him in the skies as he perform his step and fetch it facsimile for those racist white boys and racist white girls. You know the Republican Party has, for the past 35, 40 years, only legislated policies that was a benefit an advantage to rich Republicans, Americans, and wealthy, white-owned, white-controlled corporations like the big oil companies, the big banks, Wall Street, General Electric, etc., etc. The policies that the Republicans will pass and enact making it a law always benefit wealthy folks, big business, Wall Street, the big banks, and wealthy wealthy white Republicans. Their policies never ever benefit the middle class and people that are living in poverty below the poverty level. Their policies never create economic conditions in an environment whereby those policies enhance the social 
social economic status of people that are living in poverty and the middle class. There are 140 million people in America that are living in poverty. Almost one half of the American population are living at or below the poverty level, my beautiful, intelligent black brothers and sisters. Think of that. The wealthiest country on the planet, almost half of its citizens, families, are living in poverty. And the legislation that is passed by that party of traitors and criminals called the Republican Party always benefit the wealthy and big businesses. Policies never do anything for the middle class and those 140 million Americans that are living in poverty. The Republican Party are indeed traitors. They have been on a mission the last 35, 40 years to fix every election that they possibly can. They have been on a mission to stop black folks, people that look like me, from being able to vote and exercise their franchise ability to vote. The Republican Party know that their constituents are shrinking because their constituents are 99 and 9 tenths percent white folks. And white folks are slowly becoming a minority right here on this plantation called America. The Republicans are aware of that. Hence is why they want to create stricter immigration laws. They want to stop brown folks and black folks from being able to come to America. Hence is why they uh, created voter restrictions and voter ID laws to stop black folks and brown folks from voting. Because when the voter turnout is large, Republicans will always lose. The only way Republicans can win elections right now is to cheat. They have to create voter ID laws, they have to close voting locations, they have to restrict the time allowed for voters to vote, and they have to gerrymander the districts whereby the Republican politicians get to choose who their voters will be. The only way Republicans can win is to cheat. And that's what they have been doing for the past 35, 40 years. And in the era of Trump, it's getting worse. They are now uh, enlisted, conspiring with foreign enemies to fix, to win elections right here on this plantation called America. They are conspiring with Saudi Arabia, China, the Russians, and, and maybe even North Korea. Who knows what those traitors and criminals of the Republican, Republican Party are willing to do in order to win an election 
in order to sustain and grow the power machine that they have in place today on the 19th of June in the year of 2020. Never trust or believe anything that a Republican is saying because when a Republican's lips are moving, they align. All things, all things created by Republicans will benefit wealthy folks and big business. Absolutely unequivocally. All things, all laws, all legislation created by the Republican Party will not benefit the majority of the American people. Another thing that the Republican have been on a mission to do in the past 10 years is to stack the federal courts with white supremacy believing judges. And by the way, all of these judges are white. They just installed another one on the federal in the federal district in Washington DC a few days ago. They have installed more than 250 white supremacy believing judges on the federal court during the past 10 years, my beautiful, intelligent black brothers and sisters. The Republican Party is an enabler of Trump. Just as Trump is trying to destroy the modified democracy of this republic, the Republican Party is right in the same boat, boat with Trump and his administration, enabling Trump, enabling Trump to destroy the democracy and normalize all of the criminal activities, all of the bullshit that Trump has displayed, done, uh, in plain sight, and much more of it is in secret and never have seen the light of day. Nevertheless, the Republican Party is in bed with Trump, hanging on to his testicles for as long as they can, uh, not wavering one iota. The Republican Party is a party of traitors and criminals. And the head criminal is Trump that punk-ass white boy that sits in the white boy house. For the past three, four decades, the Republican Party has been on a mission not to legislate. They have been on a mission to maintain their power grab and to enhance that power by any means possible. That's what I have on this one. Please go to the thrashaway.libsyn.com. There you will have access to all that I do.